Welcome to Wisdom Will. In this video, we'll explore the complex factors that impact financial well-being. Poverty is not solely a result of personal failings. Societal, economic, and personal factors play a significant role. From income disparity to limited access to education and unforeseen circumstances, these challenges perpetuate poverty. However, through financial literacy, multiple income streams, wise investments, and skill development, we can take control of our financial destiny. Join us as we uncover the reasons behind financial disadvantage and empower ourselves for a brighter future. Poverty is not an accident, like slavery and apartheid. It is man-made and can be removed by the actions of human beings. According to Nelson Mandela, this quote emphasizes that poverty is not a random occurrence but a result of deliberate human actions. Mandela draws parallels between poverty, slavery, and apartheid, highlighting their common origins as social constructs. He asserts that just as these man-made systems were created, they can be dismantled through the collective efforts and actions of individuals. Honesty most people tend to evade responsibility for two crucial aspects, their financial status and their physical weight. If you are watching this video, it means you have access to Wi-Fi and a device that connects you to the global economy, leaving no excuses for not being able to figure out how to improve your financial situation in 2023. However, it is important to note that there are individuals who are genuinely content with their modest income and love their lives. You can discern their sincerity by looking into their eyes, as they don't merely use coping mechanisms to justify their circumstances. While not everyone is destined to become a millionaire, if you find yourself dissatisfied with your financial situation, it indicates a desire for change. It is crucial to mention that weight is also a topic where honesty is lacking. People who accept their weight and acknowledge the need for potential improvement do not trouble me. However, it is disheartening to witness individuals who constantly provide numerous justifications for their weight, leading to a sad existence where they deceive themselves. They usually tell themselves that they have a problem with eating. Or sometimes, they complain about how hard exercising is and they cannot do it. We all have flaws, and some people enjoy drinking or smoking despite its negative health implications. Yet, some people are very aware of the consequences and make a conscious decision to indulge in moderation. They are responsible with smoking and drinking, and they usually limit their selves when doing it. The ability to objectively assess our choices without feeling attacked or flawed is crucial. The primary cause of your financial struggles is the inability to objectively evaluate your life without allowing your ego to be damaged and without feeling the need to provide countless excuses for your current situation. Identity in today's world, it is widely accepted that identities can be fluid and subject to change. People can switch interests, fashion styles, and even gender identities with minimal physical alteration. However, when it comes to financial status, society tends to reject the notion of changing identities. While someone can identify as a different gender without altering their body, identifying as wealthy despite one's current financial situation is met with criticism. This paradox highlights the peculiarities of our modern society. It is essential to recognize that your financial situation is in fact an aspect of your identity. This perspective differs from the past, where access to information was limited. Nowadays, anyone can access the same knowledge that has helped others achieve immense wealth. Despite this accessibility, many individuals remain stagnant. The reason behind this stagnation lies in a deeply ingrained subconscious identity as someone who is poor. It's important to consider that if we go back 200 years, my perspective would have been different. 
The transformation began around 1840 when the Bible was translated from Latin into English, marking a shift towards the democratization of information. Over the last approximately 500 years, knowledge has become more accessible with the rise of literacy and the ability to read books. Even though things have improved, let's say a century ago, the situation wasn't quite like it is today. In the present day, anyone with an internet connection, including all of you watching this, can access the same information that others have used to amass fortune of millions, tens of millions, or even hundreds of millions of dollars. Despite having equal access to this valuable knowledge, many individuals remain stuck in their current circumstances. It's crucial to question why this is the case. And the answer? lies in the deep-seated subconscious identification as someone who is financially impoverished. This belief is firmly entrenched within your subconscious mind, and it greatly influences your financial reality. This mindset stems from various influences, including upbringing and societal programming. It is crucial to evaluate your situation objectively and recognize the subconscious programming that may be holding you back. By consciously changing your financial identity, you can transform your life and embrace the mindset and traits of financial abundance. Not understanding money One of the key factors that can contribute to financial struggles is a lack of understanding about money. Many people find themselves in challenging financial situations simply because they don't have a solid grasp of basic financial concepts. Without this understanding, it becomes difficult to make informed decisions about saving, investing, and managing expenses effectively. Financial literacy is crucial for navigating the complexities of the modern economy. When individuals lack knowledge about budgeting, debt management, and the importance of building wealth, they often fall victim to poor financial habits and impulsive spending, which can lead to long-term financial hardships. Moreover, a lack of understanding about money can also result in a failure to recognize the opportunities for growth and wealth creation. It's not just about earning a higher income. It's about knowing how to make that income work for you. Without understanding the power of compound interest, the benefits of long-term investing, or the potential of diversifying income streams, individuals may miss out on opportunities that build wealth over time. Furthermore, without a solid understanding of money, individuals may fall prey to scams, predatory lending, or risky financial decisions that can further exacerbate their financial struggles. By developing a deeper understanding of money, individuals can gain the knowledge and confidence needed to make smart financial choices and improve their financial well-being. Excessive Consumption It's crucial to recognize that our current financial situation stems from a lack of productive output. Instead of creating value, you predominantly consume resources, which prevents you from attaining wealth. To achieve prosperity, it's essential to generate something that the markets demand, be it a service, a product, or any other valuable contribution. When you create something that others consume, you establish a reciprocal relationship where they compensate you monetarily. This principle also extends to your online presence. Understand that while being a consumer on platforms like YouTube and TikTok is perfectly acceptable, for instance, enjoying a brief video during a meal, excessive consumption, spending 3 to 4 hours daily on TikTok, for example, hinders your progress. If creating content aligns with your goals, engage in both consumption and creation. However, if it doesn't contribute to your desired path, consider deleting irrelevant apps such as Instagram and TikTok as they offer no practical use. Ultimately, remember that one of the primary reasons for your financial limitations is an excessive focus on consuming rather than creating, either digitally or in terms of tangible products or services. And there you have it! Please share any advice 
good stories or inquiries you may have regarding this video in the comments section below. I'm Wisdom Will. Thanks for watching this video and see you again next time. Have a great day.